Julie. Mac. Hi. Hi. The camera's rolling. It is. My cup of tea's cold. How's yours? <laughs> Mine's just warm. I've just made it. That's no good, is it? I know, but yours was warm. <laughs> In the background, the children seem like they're revving up. They are, so we better get on with it. Better crack on. I think they might burst in and ruin it. Never mind. Let's go. What are we talking about today? Today we're talking about our option to choose a piano for you. Choose a piano for you so the customer doesn't have to visit. No. Nope. If they don't want to. Or if you can't. Here's a handy graphic. Hey. To say we can narrow down the choices and choose one for you. We do have an FAQ. Should we go and find it? Let's go and find the FAQ. All right. Jumping across to the main website. Scrolling down to find it. Oh, and there's there. the graphic again. There it is. Okay, so let's go through this one and see where we end up. So, do we do this often or do most people visit? What's um, what's the situation? I do recommendations for people who can't come or um, are too busy to come to the showrooms, got too many children to come to the showrooms, uh, don't live near the showrooms, um, or just simply want our advice. Um, I do this quite often, to be honest. Okay. Um, Mm. And I'm yet to have negative feedback about it. Everybody is very happy with the pianos. Mm. So, so it's not unusual to buy this way from Not us. at all. Not okay. at all. What are some other things you ask the customer to help find a suitable piano for them, Julie? There are a few questions that we do initially ask, which are what is the room type like where the pianos go in? So, for instance, uh, is it a carpeted room? Does it have hard floors, high ceilings? Um, okay. So then we can decide what kind of tone they're looking for. Also ask them, do they prefer a U1 or a U3? The U1 is nice and small. The U3 is a bit taller. Yes, and then I ask them kind of what budget they're looking at. And mm. then we can go from there. That's good. The next step is that you tend to send them then a, an email with two or three pianos. Yeah, I usually liaise with the tech who's um, on site. And I will pick two, we will we will pick two or three pianos that we think would be suitable for the customer's room type, budget, um, and playing needs. Some people are very specific and they say they want to play classical um, okay. or jazz. Uh, so yeah, so we pick two or three, I send them the individual links, which has the videos and the pictures of that piano. And I just send a little blurb about each piano to say how it sounds in the bass, how it sounds in the treble, how it sounds overall and the touch. That's good. Now it sounds a bit risky buying online if you've never been to the shop and you've never met us in person. Yeah. So that's why we have the option to, you place your order online, but we don't want you to pay a deposit or pay for anything until the piano is in your house safely and it's arrived and it looks exactly like we've promised and at that point that's when the payment is due uh, yeah so and as it says there the only exception to that is the the finance which is a 10 percent deposit that's right but you, that's refundable if it's within the 14 days okay and mm -hmm. another way we've reduced the risk of buying this way is that we'll give you 100 days after delivery for you to change your mind and decide that the piano is not really for you yeah and if that happens you get a 100% refund with no, no return delivery fee, no restocking fee and things like that. Yeah, we found, haven't we, that over three months, you definitely know whether you like something or not. Yeah, and you can invite your piano tuner, your piano yeah, teacher, your teacher, get your friends and family around. Yeah. Okay, what about the warranty? Uh, lifetime warranty is uh, there as well. Uh, that's another thing that kind of puts people's minds at rest. Yeah. when they're looking at buying without coming to view the pianos. Hmm. So the 100-day money, 100 money-back guarantee and the lifetime warranty is a nice safety net. Moving on, we will give free delivery to a piano floor. stool and a free first tuning in your home. So everything moves on smoothly, so you can stay at home. You don't need to visit and everything just ticks along nicely. Yeah. I thought we might just briefly look into this page. What do you think, Julie? Absolutely. It's so that... nice to see these reviews. And some of these, um, a proportion of these will be people who've not visited. Yeah, some of these have not visited. We don't have it down exactly who's visited and who's yes. not. But, but just to try and reassure you that we have sold lots of pianos to many happy people, here is a quick flick through our previous customers page. I know. It's really long. It's lovely, isn't it? But it's also nice to know that it's that's not all of our customers. That's just a handful almost, really, when it comes to it. So that's quite nice. It is. Over the years, that's over the years. a small selection in the end. Yeah. So there you go. What was next on that page to talk about, if anything? 
Possibly nothing, but how to get started. You can go to our Pianos for Sale page, go to the stock list, you can expand the various different lists on there, and most pianos will have a video, so open the pages, jump along and play that video. Have a look at the pictures. The Yeah, nice these, high quality. Yeah, and these are pictures of those pianos, so that's not a stockpile picture, that is a p picture of that piano. Yeah, we don't recycle any photographs. No pictures are recycled. All the pictures are genuinely of that piano. Of that piano. Yes, Diogo takes out? a long time to do all of those pictures, doesn't he? Very he, thorough. He does. And you can watch the video. And you can watch Oliver playing. Here he is. It's not... That's a dark one. <laughs> For Oliver, yeah. Yes, so there we go. Yeah. Anything nice. else to mention on that question, Julie? No, if you're not happy with the recommendations that I make, I'm more than happy to do another recommendation, so we'll get there in the end. That's not a problem either. Um, at the moment, we've got a good stock, but usually we have around 30 pianos in stock anyway, so there's always a good choice, isn't there? I think so. Yeah. Um, I think that covers that one. I think it does. Can I have a hot brew now? <laughs> yeah, of course you can. Let's do that. Thank you, Julia, and goodbye, everyone. Thanks Bye. for watching. Bye.